1889, that's when we built our first harp. Patrick Healy went about saying, I was bringing all these European harps over to America to sell, mm. but they couldn't stand up to the climate here. No. You know, the, we had a much more drier, colder climate than Europe did. Mm. So a lot of the instruments in Boston, New York, uh, you know, the East Coast areas, mm. they weren't holding up. So Lion Healy started building their own harp. And we made a lot of huge improvements on the mechanism side that made it much more adjustable so that the player themselves could adjust it. Uh, we call this the mechanism, sort of the, the brains of the harp, if you want to call it that. Mm -hmm. um, and that's where the discs and the linkage up there that change the pitch while a harpist is playing. Okay. It was because it was near and dear to Patrick Healy, he was a harpist. Mm -hmm. He was born in Ireland, um, but he was a harpist himself. And it's very time consuming. You know, it's not, this is not a business that you, you uh, for lack of a better word, get rich at, but you have to have a love for it. Mm -hmm. And fortunately, the uh, owners of the company have that love. You know, they have that passion for it. It will Rather vary from off. four months to two years. Two years. Yeah, and you can get some really the hand painted soundboards, the hand carved, the gilded. They'll take two years. I'd say it's a steady business. We've survived a few recessions, a few world wars. Depression. I mean, depression. depression. We we survived the Great Depression. So this gets hand fit into this column, oh, I see. and then it has to be hand fit here. So you, all your angles have to be exactly right. So they have all these wonderful, cool little tools they use. These great little hammers, you know. And these these things have been passed down for centuries here. It seems, you know, some of these hammers are probably 80, 90 years old. What you're seeing is, I, I'm telling you, you could walk back 50, 80 years, and you'd see a lot of the same things that we're doing today down there.